Today we are showing you guys 10 of the best hidden Mickeys here at Disneyland. There oh my are goodness. so many hidden Mickeys. This is one of our favorite things to do. And we're going to show you all of the best ones that we found. And let me tell you, we have been doing this for a year. So you're about to get some good info. Hey, hey insiders. insiders! We are here at Disneyland. Now this one behind us is not technically a hidden Mickey because right. everyone comes in and sees it with but the But it's banner. like, it gives you a good idea of what you're looking for. It's the three circles in a Mickey shape. Yes, the big one and then the two outside circles. They are hidden everywhere in the park. And, and um, we're going to show you some of our favorites. They're yeah. awesome. Let's go. I will tell you though, these also don't count. <laughs> we are right here at Peter Pan's Flight and this is my favorite hidden Mickey of all time. We're starting you off pretty good for hidden Mickey number one. This is my favorite hidden Mickey ever. It's when you're in London, so keep an eye on it. Ready guys? Alright everybody, here we go. We're off to find the hidden Mickey, my favorite, at Disneyland. Alright, you have to hold it. Hi, everybody. Here, here we go. go. Entering the amazing London scene. If you look at Big Ben, you have to wait till you're on the other side of it, but it's on the top tier window here, not on the face of the tower. Go around, and right there, Mickey is waving through a window. That's pretty cool, right? Literally hidden Mickey sitting on Big Ben, and now we're off to Neverland. I absolutely love that hidden Mickey. It's honestly probably my favorite in the whole park, except maybe Indiana Jones, because it's right in the thick of things on the ride. I love it. All right, go, go, go. All right, so for a little backstory, hidden Mickeys were placed all around the park. They're on your favorite rides and some of our favorite places. Uh, there's some here on Main Street, if we're being honest. So many people wonder how hidden Mickeys actually started in the parks. Now, I think this is kind of a cool trivia fact because hidden Mickeys weren't originally part of Disneyland. It wasn't until Epcot was being built, Disney decided they didn't want any Disney characters to be seen anywhere in the parks. So the Imagineers took that as a challenge and they took Mickeys and they hid them all throughout the park so that they were following the rules. You could not see any Mickeys or Disney characters in Epcot. They were hidden throughout the parks. And then it started this really cool like scavenger hunt of people trying to find these hidden Mickeys. Disney placed these just to add a little extra touch of magic when you're here at the parks. So this is hidden Mickey number two. It's in this corner. Uh, Kara actually found this one. It's pretty cool. All right, so this one is right across from Ronto Roasters and the Black Spire Outpost, like where the marketplace is. And it's directly up on the building. You gotta look straight up, but it's right there. Blaster holes in the shape of Mickey once again. All right, there are a couple Best other. Best to do a hidden Mickey, I think. I think so. Now there are a couple other hidden Mickeys here at Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. So we'll let's move on to the next one. Check this one out right here. If you come around this way, these three blaster holes make a perfect hidden Mickey. Now as soon as you exit the ride, <laughs> Smuggler's Run, if you turn right and go up the ramp, that's where you can find this hidden Mickey. It's kind of out of the way, but there are also a few other hidden Mickeys on some attractions that are really, really cool. This next hidden Mickey is on Rise the Resistance, and it's so insane that we never saw it until a cast member who was working the ride sent us a video after it was closed. Next time you ride Rise of the Resistance, let us know if you can find this hidden Mickey. In the room with Kylo Ren when he's using the force on you, if you turn around and look behind you, you will notice that on the control panel is a hidden Mickey. And one of the coolest hidden Mickeys is here on Buzz Lightyear, the planet Earth, Sector One. It's an actual Mickey. It's Mickey Mouse. That's awesome. Mickey the Mouse, I love that one. It appears three times while you're in the line for the ride. It's perfect. You can see it a couple times. It's in sector one up there. Yep. It's awesome because it's in the line. So like it's something to do while you're in line. But since we're in line for Buzz just to show you this hit Mickey, I'm gonna win. <laughs> He's funny. So dad, you won. 9.55, baby. Nice. Congratulations. Dad got 9.55. 9.55. 9.55. All right, so if you look right behind us, this is one of the hardest hidden Mickeys ever because literally this spot's under construction. It moves. Sometimes it's here and sometimes it's in the dining area. Yeah. But because it's closed, they moved it out here. So fun fact about this hidden Mickey and why we know it exists. So it was the year of a million dreams, Disneyland's 50th anniversary. And we won a private tour at Disneyland. We actually won. So we'll get more into the story of winning and what that day looked like in a later video. But when we won, we got a private tour of Disney and they showed us this hidden Mickey. They actually let um, us walk out. It was super crazy. Yeah. It was, it was when the park was closed and there was actually a place where we could stand in 15 years ago. <laughs> yeah, but we'll zoom so. in now. You'll see a picture of that picture. And in the picture is Mickey standing just as a guest on the boat. Yeah, so. 
that is the next hidden Mickey, it's and like, I guess it's so hard to find. Yeah. So, yeah. ready? Next hidden Mickey. This next one, we came all the way over to DCA to ride the Incredicoaster because this is one of my favorite hidden Mickeys. It's, it's actually so hard to find. It's actually been here since it was California Screaming. That's how old this hidden Mickey is. It is. But you How's guys. It's not that old. Uh, hey, it's pretty old. Okay, Sorry. since California Screaming <laughs> started. Oh, it's pretty old. <laughs> no, but this hidden Mickey, I think, is pretty awesome. Um, it's literally when you're on the loop de loop, look straight up, it's right there. Let's show you where it is. You guys, this is one of the craziest hidden Mickeys ever. It's on the loop in the Incredicoaster. Literally, when you're upside down on the loop de loop, is the only time you can see this hidden Mickey. All right, here we go. All right, guys, we're going on the loop de loop. Be sure you're looking at the ground. I hope you guys found that hidden Mickey. Did you see it? Did you see? No? It's very hard to find. We're going to show you the replay right now because it's really, really hard to see. But I do love the Incredicoaster. Did you see it? Here, we'll play it at half speed. What about now? All right, do you guys see it now? I don't. You don't? I totally do, dude. We're 25% and zoomed in. It's right there. Look, look at the Oh. <laughs> when they were building California Screamin', they had these pillars that holds up the attraction to the left of the track, and they added one extra plate to make it a hidden Mickey. All right, if you look over here where I cart they circle, there's this tiny little spot right on the floor. Right here. Hidden Mickey. Hidden Mickey. That's crazy. Isn't that crazy? It's, so it's direct though, like you, that's why it's there. Like, that's so cool. And, and it's, it's right, right by... 1901, like, which is the Club 3 equivalent in DCA. Yes, it's right here in front of 1901. Just go right down. Right there. Right there. Pretty cool. All right, before we get to the hardest hidden Mickey to find, here are some honorable mentions of some of our favorites. These ones in particular you can find on our TikTok at Hey Insiders. We have so many more hidden Mickeys on our TikTok, like this one at the Little Mermaid. In the Kiss the Girl scene, on the left side of the very front are two frogs, and on their backs, they have hidden Mickeys. Next, we have this one right outside the Guardians of the Galaxy Mission Breakout ride. If you look around as you're exiting the store, as you exit the ride, there's all these tiny little spots on the ground that's like some acid spill. And if you look, one of the patterns actually makes a hidden Mickey. It's pretty awesome. Hidden Mickey right there. Oh. The only reason this Hidden Mickey on Soarin' Over California didn't make the list is because it's actually Soarin' Over the World right now, but they do bring Over California back seasonally. But as you're flying over this amazing golf course on Soarin' Over California, this guy's gonna hit a golf ball at you. When he smacks the golf ball, did you catch it? There's a Hidden Mickey on the golf ball. It's such a great Hidden Mickey. Now it's time for our favorite Hidden Mickey. <laughs> So this is probably one of my favorite hidden Mickeys of all time. Oh my god, it's so cool. Yeah, so when you're riding the ride, um, you're gonna walk into that room where there's like a ton, where it's like wide open with a skeleton. Then you're gonna turn left into a room of skeletons. And he's wearing a Mickey hat. Yeah, that's, there's gonna be one skeleton pressed up against the back wall. That's the one wearing the Mickey hat, but you literally have to turn and look will be right there. It's like right behind you. So, so keep an eye out. Yeah. We're gonna show you that hidden Mickey. All right, we're in line now for Indiana Jones. This is one of my favorite hidden Mickeys because it's like, it's not just a hidden Mickey. It's not just a Mickey symbol somewhere. This is a skeleton on Indiana Jones that's wearing a Mickey ear hat. It's this, it's the classic look. It's kind of like the blue or purplish kind of hat. And there's two Mickey ears. The skeleton's wearing it. It's right after Indy is holding those massive doors right at the beginning of the ride. All right, we're gonna find one of the craziest hidden Mickeys. It's right behind the camera. Like, it's gonna be like right there. As we said, we're in this room where Indiana Jones is holding those massive doors. You come around the corner, you see all the fire and stuff, and you turn to the left straight into a skeleton room. And the second you get into that room, you have to look to your left and behind you, and there's a skeleton wearing an ear hat. All right, so as you can see, it's pretty impossible to video that section, but we will throw in the photo, and you see pretty much where it is. Like I said, you point at it, it's at like 7 o'clock, like right to your left, not quite behind you, but like right there. You'll see it if you try it. It took us twice, but... We still didn't get a great video, but you know where it is. So it is apparently basically impossible to catch us on camera while riding the ride. So here's a photo that we found on Disney Parks blog just to prove that it exists. It really does, you guys. That's what he looks like. It's in the room in this back corner here, and it's very hard to find. But my favorite hidden Mickey of all time. 
All right, so we're back here at a not very hidden Mickey. No, no it's, it's kind of an obvious Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of an out there Mickey. It but, is. Um, Thank no. you guys so much for watching. And if there is a hidden Mickey that we missed, then comment down below and let us know. Yes. Or which hidden Mickey was your favorite? Yeah. yeah, let us know right now. We'd love a comment, and we'll see you next time. Yeah, be, be sure, sure to subscribe. subscribe. Bye. Bye, guys.